Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to open handless browser means how to work on handless browser testing in a robotic framework. Why required handless browser in our testing means see whenever you open the browser we required for browser activities right means the browser whenever we open browser we mentioned that it will what will happen it will open the browser that particular browser then it will do some operation then we, we are watching for that particular browser activities correct and handless browser is nothing but it will reduce that time of opening and doing all the operations it will directly it will do for back end and it will do for some operations okay how we can able to do it here by using handless browser a simple login page now this is the page chrome and entering value and closing okay this is the one i need to copy here can able to open this one tc22 dot robot okay now i'm copy pasting that entire code here just i need to uh, mention and less chrome okay this is the one we can able to specify then it will open nothing to change anything the browser which is the browser we are going to uh, specify right that browser place we are going to doing for handless if you add handless then it will open for handless browser okay if you are not specify handless it will open for normal browser whether it is working or not we can able to see here is it 22 and you can able to you will not able to see for any execution here it just it will open for backend see the dev tools listening on this is the server it is failing because of something is missing okay but it is open the browser and doing some operations but handless chrome element not found something it is not able to finding some element okay then we can able to do some comment here not to call that one opening the browser only just opening the browser but it is not able to find some web element due to that it is failing just i'm opening the browser but it will call for some dev tools inside that some url local url then only it will call and it will pass we can able to do some operation something it is missing not able to find some value due to that it is failed that i commented it is working okay you can able to try some other way of testing then also you can able to find some that operations okay then you can able to add some comment on this video whether you can able to achieve that those things or not you can able to share the, those comments into this particular video in case if you are facing something issue you can able to comment then i will try to resolve i'll try to resolve most of the time okay that's all about this video i hope you understand this video if you like this video, please like me please subscribe my youtube channel don't forget to share your friends and colleagues thank you